Okay, I know this is kind of janky. Well, it's really janky, but anyways, here's the Raspberry Pi. And this right here is the HDMI to VGA converter that I got for 13 bucks on eBay. And uh, it is hooked into a cord, of course. And it goes all the way up to here. And what I did was I broke out um, a VGA port off of an old video card. And I plugged it into some headers for a power supply. You can see right there. So I'm using those three wires and the other three are hanging off on both sides. Down here at the bottom um, with the black wires, those are red, green, and blue. And up here at the top, that's uh, ground, horizontal, and vertical sync. And uh, so now that I can show you something without a flashlight, it's kind of sideways and it's kind of split down the middle. But that is the display on my arcade cabinet. Sorry it's so dark in here. I have no idea why this light's so bad in here. But So it works. I just have to adjust the picture and flip it. And the sound you hear is the old cart playing in the background. Um, I didn't disconnect the sound yet, but I'll let you know. Basically what I'm going to do is leave the old cartridge in and put a switch and it's going to switch the video and audio over so that the cartridge will always play in the background and the Raspberry Pi will always play in the background it will always be on and you can just switch over and play the original game or you can play one of the 3,000 other games I have 4,000, probably 5,000 by the time I'm finished but there you go there's the arcade cabinet